Any transportation tracks, animals are coming in and out of them. Plants are moving on these these tracks. This is why this is so diversified, is that seeds are able to blow down these corridors that are left open all the way from the west suburbs. It's like Aurora. <laughs> Coyotes run walk back and forth here. I love how, I mean, plants are trespassing all the time, right? They're blowing all over the place. They're sticking to the bottom of our shoes. So this is burdock. This is where Velcro came from. You pass these seeds around and look at the little hooks. You break up this thing, it's gonna have lots of plants in there. <laughs> <laughs> this is where the there we go. <laughs> was invented by someone uh, Scandinavian. Is this sleeping right now? I don't this is uh, done. It's a biennial, which means it takes two years until the plant dies. So it's a two year, so the first year it just gives the leaves, second year it grows its flower stalks, it's out of the seeds, the whole thing dies. There's no root here at this point, particularly because this is here. But uh, it, the root rots down, creates an open passage for water and air to move through the soil. So it's bettering the soil just for that. Like delicate, it's delicate, it's weird, really weird, <laughs> and moving. It's just tricky. It could be good. It could be bad. I'm kind of in between survival, survivalist, and a gourmand. Mulberry tree, edible. It tastes like poppy seed, but it's finer. Grind them up with your bread. So many pears and apples and cherries and plums. Put in your pancake mix and even hearty kiwi. There is a kiwi that grows here, and we had it. Oh wow! So it produces a lot. It produces a lot of seed. And that's gonna, I can stick it in my mouth now, but it's gonna be real dusty. Is that what smells so strong? Yeah, it should smell pretty strong. Yeah. If you start incorporating wild plants into your food, then you won't have to think about taking medicine. No, These leaves are really good for toilet paper if you're outside and it's a, a, one of the common names is called camper's delight. It's the best <laughs> thing to wipe your butt with. But it's really good for asthma if you take it internally. <laughs> and then that stalk that comes up as all, you know, when it's um, dried, when all the flowers are dried before the seeds come out, that thing, you can light it like a tiki torch and that, and that sucker burns for a really long time and they were used, dipped in tallow, they were used in castles to light hallways. So they were gathered from fields. Um, so the first year you're not gonna get that, but the second year you're gonna get that. These are all these despised weeds in our landscape. <laughs>